In this video, we are going to discuss about virus. So you can see in this figure here, a virus is like a disease for our computers. What is a virus? Virus is any malicious program that attaches itself to a host that is another program and replicates itself on our system. So there are two important points to be noted here. It needs a host program. It needs another program to function. And the second thing is that when it reaches our system, our computer system, it will replicate itself. There was just one small program and now it will be hundred or thousands of small, small programs that are present on our system. So what this does to our system? It will slow down, it will corrupt or destroy the complete computer system. These are some of the harmful activities that these hundreds or thousands of small little virus programs can do to our system. Take up memory space. Obviously, there are so many small program segments, so they'll use the precious memory space on our system. It will access private information like credit card details. Whatever information we are saving on our system that can be accessed by these virus. It will flash unwanted messages or the user screen that is how the virus is prepared so it will you are doing some work you are writing your program or you are creating a document and suddenly some meaningless messages will be thrown up on your system so you get diverted you have to close it and then you start working again so it eats into your time then it can corrupt your data the data that is stored on your hard disk drive or even any external storage memory that you are using like pen drives, it can corrupt the data that is there and it can spam email contacts. It will, virus will spread itself to the other email contacts when you send your email to your friends, your colleagues or any other contact. So in this video, we have understood what a virus is, how it harms our network system, our computer system. In the next video, we are going to discuss about Trojan horse.